Hi, I'm Bob Belcher. Uh, my grandson and I are from the Denver area in Colorado. I'm Marie Sharp, and I'm from Washington, D.C. This is our first Road Scholar experience. All together, 17. Uh, it's been seven for adults, and uh, three international, and seven intergenerational. Really been a fantastic experience for us. Whereas I wanted a fun, but yet focused activity for my grandson, and we definitely received that. Um, also, it's very educational. I'm, I have a teaching background, and I really feel like um, what we communicate to children is really important. Now, he's 10 years old, so you know how much is a 10-year-old going to absorb? Who knows? But uh, he seemed to have a great time. It's a set-aside time for just grandma and, or grandpa and grandchild. And the one-on-one -on -one dynamic is really great. Uh, you know, as grandparents, that's probably one of our greatest hopes and aspirations is to try to provide a number of learning experiences and a different environment for them than what we grew up with. This is what our grandchildren will remember. If you look at 10, 20 years from now, looking back, what is our legacy? And, and a desire to have that, that legacy with the grandchildren. They'll remember this. Yeah, but when I grew up, uh, none of this was around. You know, this experience wasn't available, but for him, I hope it leaves an impression because as he grows up and becomes an adult, you know, the world is going to require a number of uh, talents and expertise that they're going to have to come up with, and hopefully this will at least set the stage for that. And Road Scholar does that. They, they have a nice uh, uh, kaleidoscope of activities and that get them physically involved and mentally involved. But I guess the one common denominator all the grandparents wanted their grandkids to have a, a good educational experience. They want them to have fun, but fun with a purpose. I think it's great. Curiosity is important in a child, and here that, that can happen.